everybody, and good morning, and welcome to our garden. My name's Guy. I'm going to be with you for the next three hours. We've got a great show. It kind of got a little cool, right? Got a little cool today. It's like in the in the 60s, which is kind of nice. A beautiful day. Uh, hopefully, it's going to be gorgeous wherever you live. We have a lot of things to do in this show. Three hours. I'm going to pace myself. Jared, my producer, tell me to slow down if I start getting crazy. But it's a crazy three hours because we got really, really cool stuff. Some stuff you've never seen before. I've got stuff, I've got the, uh, the um, um, some designer stuff, some decor stuff that's 50% off and more. So lots of really cool things. We're doing $40 off if you get a brand new HSN credit card. We're giving away a $25 gift card. What's our question of the day? What are you doing for Easter? How about that? What are you cooking? Are you hanging? You got family coming? So what are you doing? Here are the birds. Oh, the lovely birds. Everybody's here in the garden. Uh, anyway, uh, so we got lots of things to go that are going on. I'm going to do my promotion in a minute, but I want to check our mailbox and remind you that um, we are giving away that 25 bucks, and the way that you can get it is to just go on our Facebook page, right, and just leave your comment. You know, what do you want to talk? You want to say hi? I don't care. Or what do you do for Easter? Uh, and whoever we pick is going to get 25 bucks. So our hey, mail hi. will you be coming mail. here. There's the question. What are you doing for Easter? Okay, so that's it. We're gonna check on it a little bit later. You hear those birds? You know what they're doing? Lindsay, you know what they're doing? They're calling for food. The, the birds wanna be fed. Remember, whether you have uh, Blue Jays, Cardinals, Robins, whatever it is, if you want them, maybe not Blue Jays, because they're, <laughs> they're kind of mean, but if you want the birds to come, you have to feed them. I've got my bird feeder up here, and we have this available. It's a really neat feeder. It's a two-stage feeder, so you have seed on one level, and then you've got the hummingbird food on the bottom, so that you'll get both, and every state in the union has hummingbirds. I don't know if you knew that, but you gotta put the food out if you want them to come. All right, so I'm gonna sit here just for a sec. Here's my promo. We have not had, a, had these on the show in a while, okay? They sell out every time. It is our uh, leaf and petal four piece mini rose collection. I want you to look at these, okay? Look at the, you can come on in and take a peek. Look at the colors in that ruby red. We have lavender roses, okay? Red, lavender. The ones over there are, are those, um, they're almost like an orange color, like a peachy orange. Look at those. And then you're also gonna get, whoop, I'll slide the yellow over. You're also gonna get the yellow. You get all four of these, all right? In little pots, all right? Put them out. They're gonna be like this by midsummer. They're gonna be absolutely gorgeous. What's the price on those, Jared? Does that say $24.90? $24.95. You get all of these. That's my big pick in this hour. Remember, we got three hours, uh, but we're really excited. We are doing a price on our offset umbrella I've never thought we could ever do before. It's our best value of the day. We still have all the colors. Here we go. Your next presentation about our today's special. So I would have to classify this as truly the ultimate everything umbrella. You know, a lot of people have issues with umbrellas. You know the ones that you have to put in the center of a table? Uh, well, that's great if you're always at the table. What if you're sitting out on a lounge chair? What if you're out in your backyard? Like me, what if I'm on my deck, right, which I can't even get a picnic table on? Well, this is the perfect solution to that. Not only that, it's lit. It's got LED lights built into it. And there's look at how beautiful that LED light medallion is. So when you're under it, you're completely protected. Now, you all know I'm a pretty, pretty big guy, right? I want you to look at the size of this umbrella. I actually have a hard time finding umbrellas that can, fit, that can fit me and a partner, right? But look at how big this umbrella is, and it's offset. What that means is that you can put it anywhere and you can be un under it. The problem with a, with a center pole umbrella, everybody has to be at a table or a round chair or a round table. That, that's the only place you can sit under it. All right, yeah, sure, you can bring it to the beach, but then you gotta haul it out there, you gotta work it into the sand. The nice thing about this umbrella is it has this base. We are also offering, and I am, I am <laughs> put it this way, I'm buying the, one of these today in the multi-stripe, and I'm also gonna get the base. We're providing the base because you need over 100 pounds, about 120 pounds of weight to keep this umbrella so that it's uh, down to the ground. We are offering that with free shipping and handling. I'll put the information up with that in just a bit. There it is. Get them both, you obviously need it. I mean, if you wanted to, you could do sandbags, or something like that, or you could try to stick it in the ground. However, I don't recommend that. What, I, what we say is get our, um, our uh, base to go along with it. You just fill it with water. So it's easy to take with you. If you want to take it camping uh, somewhere, you can just empty it out. When you get there, you fill it with water, and that's the weight that holds it down. Because on windy days, you want to make sure it's not winding up in the neighbor's yard. So here's what we're doing. 
I don't know if you can see the price over there. 159, okay, for one day, we drop it to 89. My producer, Jared, and I were talking today. He's like, do you believe the price of that umbrella? I'm like, it's crazy. That's why everybody here is buying one. We have all colors available. The one that is over my head is red, all right? I also have it available in sage. I have it available in navy. There's a cover ca a color called latte, which is the, uh, the most popular color. And then I have it in the one I'm gonna get today, which is the multi-stripe. It is free shipping and handling. So the money you're saving off this, take a little of that money, get the base. We also have a cover available. I think that's 20 bucks if you wanna get a cover. Uh, this is all fade resistant, UV protected. It has loads of features. It even has a vent at the top, which allows the hot air that rises to escape. So honestly, it, it hits on every single bell and whistle. But, but I think the greatest thing of the whole thing, and Deb Byers is coming out in just a sec, the, the best part, no more cranking. No more dealing with that, right? There's a little pin at the top of it, and all you do is you pull the pin, just like that. There's a handle, watch. I just let it drop. There you go. How easy is that? Watch, you wanna see me put it back up? You just pop it up, all right? Get it above the little hole, put the little pin in. Look at that, right? Look at how easy that is. All right, let me get our special guest out here. Her name is Deb Byers, and I gotta tell you, Deb, these things, are, the price is ridiculous. The quality is second to none. And I think at this time of year, everybody is thinking, I wanna get outside. I don't wanna be burned by the sun. I wanna have a great time, and I want something that my whole family can basically sit under, and that's what you have here. Welcome to our show. Well, thank you, Guy, and you're absolutely right. You can get your entire family under this nine-foot umbrella. Nine feet of 360 degrees protection from the sun, UVA protected, will protect you from a light rain because it's water resistant and water repellent. So believe me, it rained yesterday and the water just beads up. But then at night, you've got this beautiful light fixture that's going to give you 28 LED lights. So now your umbrella can go from day to night for you to enjoy it with your family. And you're absolutely right. The way to go ahead and open and close it could not be easier. The days of having to crank it, you're right, are gonna be gone. And no more having to pull up all the strength in order to get it into this beautiful position because there's no center pole. Everything is behind you. And if you're alone, you don't have to call somebody to come and help you to open it or close it because it's one touch. Now, you're a strong guy. I'm not a strong guy. And I'm gonna walk around there because I want you to see how easy it is for me to do it because I am just, you know, me. And if you have something that's difficult to use, you're not going to use it. But the improvements team improved on the mechanism to give us something that's going to make this umbrella absolutely user friendly. So to your point, the handle is right here in the back. I could put it on the side, but the most important thing is it's giving me that nine feet of coverage. I simply push it down just like that. And I'm not straining. I reach up, I release this pin. And by the way, the pin is kept on a chain so you never have to worry about losing it. The pin keeps your umbrella in the upright position. There's a little hole there, you'll just fill it. Now I'm simply going to release the handle and it closes just like that, boom. Couldn't be easier. Oh, wow. Even a kid can do it. Now, the other thing, too, is at night you want to close your umbrella or on a particularly windy day, just for safety's sake, you get a self-tie. So you can simply tie it shut, boom, until you're ready to open it again, release it, and then all you need to do is open it up. <laughs> and, Guy, it is absolutely amazing. It's <clears throat> like we've revolutionized the way you yeah. use an umbrella. It couldn't be any better than this, except... It really is because now you can gather with your family during the day and because we've got that lighting feature, you can do it at night as well. It's going to give you back your outdoor living space and have you enjoy your yard all over again. It's fabulous. Guys. Yeah, and I, I love that mechanism. Watch this again. It's just up or down. You're using leverage, a little of your body weight, so you don't have to worry about being, you know, like a big muscle-bound person to be able to do it. You're not fighting with it. <clears throat> you don't have anything to crank. And you know, a lot of times when you have that pulley crank, 
It's usually on a, it's usually on a string or a piece of rope. That wears all after time and breaks. It happens to every one of those crank umbrellas, right? The crank mechanism finally snaps because you're up and down, up and down. With this, because you're using um, an actual constructed piece of leverage, you're just pushing it up and down. You're not getting that wear and tear on the string or the rope that opens it up. I'm under it right here. And I, I love looking at this shot because look at how much coverage I have. I could have six or eight people underneath there, right? Or a whole bunch of kids. I mean, you can, you can get so many people under here. Our, this is a one day price. I'm buying one today. I'm so glad I waited. I had no idea of when I, I aired, you know, we air similar, uh, different styles, but umbrellas. And I've been waiting because I'm like, I need one for my back porch. You guys have seen my house. It's like, I mean, it's so hot for those four hours of the day where that sun hits right on the top of my deck, but my deck is not big. So I don't have, you know, I don't have room to be able to put a big canopy over it. I don't want to hang something. I don't want to put anything temporary up. You know, just, that's just like, because I see a lot of people just put these sunshades out there. I'm like, I want something I can open and close because I do want some sun when I want it. The nice thing about this is that it's, it's the design. It's all about the design. Offset is the way to go. I mean, don't get me wrong. If you have a table umbrella, yeah, it's great when you're eating. Problem is you're not always sitting at a table umbrella, right? You're moving around. You want to take this and put it in the yard. Uh, maybe you want to lay outside, but you don't want the sun on you. Maybe you want to take it to the park. Maybe you want to take it to your kid's t-ball game, right? They're playing in late afternoon games and you're like, it's hot. I'm, I'm the only one that's in the shade. Get these right now. The number one seller as we just went over 3,000, I believe is still latte, Jared. Is that what it is? What oh, is it navy? All right, we're, I think we're going to show you some footage of all the colors, uh, which we've got it on our on our foot right, footage right here. Hey, I want to welcome everybody who's watching today. Uh, it is Customer Appreciation Month. That's why David's holding the thank you sign up. Uh, so I've got all my friends on Facebook, Laura, Rosemary, Dawn, Judy. Uh, who else we got here? Um, I said Rosemary. Pamela's with us. William's with us. Betty. There's a lot of you today. My girl, Martina, Madeline, Sandra, Vivian, Betty, <laughs> Anita. Wow, lots and lots of piece of, of people. Priscilla, Sandra, I'll go through all those names a little bit later, but I wanted to give you all a shout out and see what you think of this umbrella because, you know, this blows away every other type of umbrella you'll have. And why do you want it now? Guys, it's April, all right? That sunshine is going to start coming out. You're going to be out there in May, June, and July and going, I wish I bought that today's special. Don't do it. I'm going to reiterate one more time a couple things. One, get the base that we're offering today, okay? Um, we lowered the price so ridiculously that we could not include the base, so it, because we're down to 89 bucks. I mean, I, you know, that's, that's a ridiculous price for an offset. What we did is we got a really good deal on the weighted base, and all you do is fill it with water. It, it, the the uh, base goes right through the bottom, right? You fill that with water. It winds up being about 120 pounds, 123 pounds of water. That will hold it down in almost any sort of a windy situation. Obviously, if you've got hurricanes or storms coming, bring it down uh, and maybe lay it on its side if it's going to be really stormy weather. But with the money you're saving today, that's a great price on this. It'll allow you to take it wherever you go. If you're a camper or a boater or a fisherman or you're traveling, you can take this with you, you know, throw it in the back of the SUV or the truck or whatever, and you can take it with you and empty out the water so you don't have to carry that weight. Otherwise, if you don't want to go for that, you can always uh, get or grab uh, sandbags or whatever you need to do. By the way, this comes with an incredible warranty, okay? Um, it's fade resistant, mildew, all that stuff, rust resistant. But if you are worried about something accidentally happening in a storm, it breaks, it falls over, it gets dinged, it's chips, it bends, whatever. We have uh, Protection Plus, it's available and it's very, very, very affordable. Do you know that five years of extra protection is only $14.99, $14. Three years is 10 bucks, three years and you get three years of protection, rips, tears, all that stuff. All right, because accidents happen. Uh, if you'd like to get it, we are extremely busy right now. That is the Navy. Uh, free shipping and handling. Hey, Jared, why don't we put up our little gift to everybody? Look at the lovely Lindsay. Uh, $40 off if you get a brand new HSN credit card. Am I correct with that? I am. How about getting this for $49.99? $49.99 is all you will pay. Uh, plus, you pay a little bit of tax. I have no control over that. That's the government. Uh, but you're going to get this thing home, and you're going to love it. Brick Red is above me. Uh, you see on, on our lifestyle shot, uh, our incredible Lindsay, who helps me out so much, she's just relaxing. That gives you another idea how beautiful it complements. Like, look at how pretty that whole setup looks with Lindsay. Look at how pretty that is, right? You got the umbrella, you got your chairs out there. She's having a little drink. It's so amazing, all right? Get it home. We are about halfway through our presentation. I'm gonna hand it back to Deb, and Deb's gonna give you some more uh, features, because Deb, the light, uh, it's, got its, own little, it's got its own little light right here. 
It's got its own little right guy, absolutely, because now you know you've got something that protects you during the day, protects you during a light rain, and gives you that ambiance at right. So you've got in the big box, and it's a big box that's going to be coming to you. Think about that for a second. You're getting an umbrella that can accommodate nine feet of coverage overhead. The pole is eight feet behind you. That's got that beautiful sliding mechanism. It's going to be delivered to you. How cool is that? You're going to set it up. I happen to have the base here. We really recommend the base. It's awesome. It's lightweight by, before you get started. It comes on wheels. Just fill it with water. It just takes a second. And then it's 123 pounds. And that's going to give you the security and the confidence to know that even on a breezy day, and it's breezy here in my backyard, your umbrella is going to stay put. So we really recommend the base. It's phenomenal. But you're getting the lights as well. They'll be in the box, in a small box. You're going to put four AA batteries that you will provide in one of each of the sections. And then all you need to do is when you set up your umbrella, there's a little knob here at the top. Just twist it and pull it down and it makes a little neck. Then you're gonna take your lights and you see there's a little spring in there. You simply put it, now you wanna have the lights down. You can put them shooting up, but for our purpose, and I think for the sense of ambiance, you want them shooting down. You simply close it up, relatch it. Hang on, I gotta get it in the right spot. There we go. Now, you press it one time and the four interior lights go on. You press it again and they go off and then 24 oh, awesome. of the outside lights go on. <clears throat> you press it a third time and you've got 28 LED lights. And let me tell you something, we pre premiered this last night and it gave beautiful light. So now you have something you can enjoy during the day to protect you from the sun. You've got something that can protect you from a light rain, which I can attest to personally because it's water resistant and the water just speeds up. And then at night, you've got a party space. This light is absolutely beautiful. It's enough to illuminate your evening. I've got my beverages over here. I've got my chairs. I'm ready to go. And to your point, I can accommodate everybody in my family under this gigantic umbrella. And this is the striped we absolutely love it. To me, the stripe represents party. So bring this into your home. By the way, of all the colors, the navy, the sage, that beautiful latte, and that beautiful pop of color red are all in this stripe. So it's a gorgeous, gorgeous array to enhance your garden and really give you all that protection and all that ambiance that you're getting with the light today, Guy. It's an amazing umbrella. It absolutely is. All right, so here's what I'll tell you. Um, right now, we still are doing okay on the umbrella. The base is gonna sell out. If you want an umbrella with a base, I have to tell you to order it right now. We only have about 200 of those, not even 150 left of those of the base. Remember, you can always use a sandbag, whatever it is that you've got heavy around the house if you want. You can, uh, we recommend that you use something on it because in a windstorm, you know, this is a, this is a sizable umbrella. So you wanna make sure that you have it weighted down. Come on over with me. I'm gonna walk over to our, uh, to, the, to the blue one that Lindsay was sitting at before just to show you. Don't bump into the umbrella right there. So look at the size of this, and I'll come around the back, because um, like I told you, I'm a, I'm a pretty big guy, I'm a tall guy, so I'm over six feet. I don't have to crouch to get under there, which is really, really nice. Uh, I, one arm, set it up, you're done, that's all you need to do. So it's, it's literally three seconds up and down without ever having to crank anything. So if you have issues with your hands or your wrists, you got, you know, a carpal whatever, or one of those, you know, things, or, or arthritis or something, you don't have to worry about that. It, you just use your weight, you just push it up, you push it down, lock in the pin, it's all you need to do. And again, we've got, I don't know if you guys can see the size of these chairs. These are really big chairs, okay? You can sort of get an idea of how big it is. And I'm under, I'm, I'm pretty much under the umbrella right here with two giant, pretty much sofa type chairs. These things are huge, right? Uh, and, and you can still get them under there so you don't have to worry about that. Navy, brick red, stripe, the multi-stripe, which has been very popular in this show. Uh, the la latte. And then what color did I miss? Uh, what one did I miss? Sage. Sage is a great color too. We don't normally get to do a color like that, so that's available as well. But get one home. I mean, to me, it doesn't, I mean, look at how good this looks, right? Can you imagine just being out on your deck if you've got a pool area? Uh, and I'm, you know, most people, uh, here in Florida, we get a lot of people that have covers, you know, screens over their, over their pools, but most people don't. So if you need an area where you want to have an, a place to cool off in the summer besides the pool, you can get under your umbrella. Uh, these are very, very portable. You can take them wherever you want. They're not super, super jumbo to, to have to travel with. And I think you're going to, you're going to love that part of it. Uh, they weigh, the, it weighs 22 pounds. 
That's it. 22 pounds is all it weighs. Super strong. There's a vent at the top. If you're looking at that shot, do you see the little uh, circular thing up there? That's actually vented. We'll climb under here. Thanks, Jed. Jed's gonna climb under. There's a little vent up underneath. It's way, way up higher. Uh, if you go up a little bit higher, you'll see it kind of underneath. There's the vent. Uh, that actually allows warm air to escape because when you think about it, if you're, if you're in an umbrella that doesn't have a vent, that heat is just going to stay trapped in there and you're not going to get any airflow. So the air blows through uh, the framework and then it just escapes right through the top. So I, I just think everybody should have one of these. I'm buying one today. I, I, I actually cannot wait to get it. I've been looking forward to this. I saw that we were uh, planning to do this a couple weeks ago and I was like, I gotta get that. 89 bucks, pretty hard to resist. And remember with a $40 brand new H cent credit card, we'll give you $40 in your account and you can use that on this as well. Deb, I it's win, win, win all the way around with this thing. It absolutely is, Guy. And now I'm in my garden around my dining table because you don't need a table with a hole. You can use virtually any table that you have because the way of having to have a hole in the table with a pole in the center and you're bobbing and weaving, talking to your guests is an old story. Now you've got that gorgeous pole behind you so you can have a conversation. You don't have to have a hole in your table. Have a square table, have a fire pit, it doesn't matter. You've got the nine feet of uninterrupted coverage that's absolutely amazing. And then at night, you have that gorgeous light to give you that ambiance with three different modes to give you light that comes down and gives you everything that you want. So if you see it now before, I took some shots before and after, that was at dusk. And then as it got later, you see that the light gives you a great deal of light. And by the way, you can use it or not use it. It's entirely up to you. And when you close the umbrella, you don't have to remove the light ring, but you've got that beautiful ambiance and you don't have to hire an electric you don't have to hire a handyman. It comes to you ready to go in the box. So think about the fact that you've got an umbrella that's going to be UVA protected, nine feet of uninterrupted space to sit with your family and enjoy. That's going to protect you in a light rain. So when it starts to rain, you don't have to scramble into the house. Just sit here and enjoy the pitter patter on this beautiful canvas. Then at night, you've got the light so you can have dinner out here and enjoy your outdoor space, whether you've got a large space or a small space. And remember, the entire pole and the base, and we strongly recommend that you grab the base before they sell out because you want that extra weight to hold it down, 123 pounds, because the, uh, the center of gravity is different on an offset, and we want you to be able to enjoy your umbrella. But absolutely every single color are fade resistant, and this is going to be a gorgeous addition to any home to protect your family during the day and to enjoy your family at night with that gorgeous light that's included. It's amazing, absolutely amazing, guys. All right, well, we are so busy right now. I think you're all recognizing a great deal when you see one. I have to update you and I apologize for this. We're gonna try to get these back, but we did sell out of the, of the bases. But remember, you can probably, you can easily, there you go, you can easily find uh, something like this online or you can, uh, what I would also do is say you can use, um, you know, bags of sand, whatever it is, to kind of weight it down. You can still move it around, but we'll get those back uh, in stock as soon as we can. But we're continuing on. $89 is a giveaway on this umbrella, all right? I, I've priced out umbrellas. Good umbrellas are always in the $150 range to be able to get one like this. And again, I'll show you how easy it is to open and close because I think that's the really, uh, really the big deal here. There is one little locking pin up top Okay, what I like to do is I just take my knee on the bottom and just push it up. That pushes it up, elevates it a little bit. And you can see, I take the pin out and I'll wait till you get to me. There goes the pin, right? Now I put my hand on the bar and I just let it, just hold it by the side and just let it drop. That's all you need to do. I'm doing it slow to show you. When you wanna open it up, all you do is you push down and you can see I am not using any real effort to do that. I lift it all the way up past the hole. I take the pin and I put the pin in. That's it. And then everything is open underneath. I've got my light, I've got my venting, I've got this incredibly uh, durable material. Uh, the, the vinyl that they use on this is top of the line. If you wanna create a space, you can make any space a cool entertaining space just by adding an umbrella, right? An umbrella is one of those things that's like a focal point, right? Everybody wants to be near it. It's like, you know, like, it's like a, it's like a campfire, right? You wanna be under the umbrella. You don't wanna be sweating your butt off all day. This is a way to do it. Um, 
We got a lot of people talking about it on. Judy just said this umbrella is awesome. Everybody's talking about it. I love it. Uh, Janet uh, says hi to everybody. I said Anita, uh, Mary. Oh my gosh, I have so many people. Roseanne, a lot of people on Facebook. All right, last thing I'm going to do is give you the colors, okay? Red. It comes in sage, which is a light green. It comes in latte, which is your creamy brown, navy, and then multi-stripe, which is the one that I'm gonna buy at the end of the show today. Uh, Deb Byers, you're amazing. <laughs> I'm not amazing, guy. The umbrella is amazing because it practically does it all. It you remember, that ease of use is just amazing and it's a fabulous, fabulous opportunity for everybody to grab it today. How about this? Everything I'm looking at there is amazing. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Thanks, Deb. We'll see you a little bit later. <laughs> Okay, guys, great. Thanks. Congratulations, everybody. All right, remember, everything is covered by a great warranty here at HSN, but if you want to go above and beyond, you know, maybe you got some crazy kids that, you know, have a BB gun and shoot holes through things. I don't know. Uh, but whatever it is, uh, we're going to protect you. How much is that again, Jared, for five... Five years of extra protection, that means it gets cut, it breaks, whatever, the, it gets blown out of the yard, whatever. You're gonna be protected with no deductibles. Three years is only 10 bucks. For three years of extra protection, it's worth it. Hey, by the way, uh, make sure you check out hsn.com. We got lots of cool stuff that's available over here. Lots to explore for. Uh, look at the watch and shop. I love that. So you can pick things out right on hsn.com. Uh, whatever it is that you need, whether it's for gifting, for yourself, for friends, for family, maybe it's holiday, uh, Father's Day, Mother's Day. Uh, we've got great deals and all kinds of great finds right there. Uh, we are gonna step away for just a second, but we're gonna come back. I'm so excited about this show. Facebook friends, I love ya. We'll be right back right after this. I'm on a hunt for the things that make life easier. You know, the products you can't live without. It's all about having the right tool for the right job. Come join me every Saturday to find out what makes me say, now that's clever. There is nothing quite like shopping with a friend. So pull up a chair and shop with us. We'll be dishing the scoop on what's hot. Catch you up on what you've missed. And share some of our favorite discoveries. Come shop with us every Saturday morning at 10 a.m. Customer Appreciation Month is all about you. So we're showing the love to our HSN Card VIPs for the entire month of April with exclusive perks like our VIP Tuesdays. Get a special offer every Tuesday in April, plus extra flex or VIP financing on every item all month long. Not a card member? Apply now and instantly get $40 off when you're approved. Visit hsn.com slash hsn card or call 1-800-284-3100 for exclusive VIP offers. preparing my home for spring by going through some of my closets, especially the garage, and just getting things cleaned up and organized. That just feels so good. I'm ready for a new season. All right, everybody, and welcome back. My name is Guy. I'll be with you for the next two and a half hours. Uh, I stay in line on our today's special. I know you all want an umbrella. Everybody wants the coolest umbrella on the planet. We've got them available for you, but we got to talk about the butterfly bush. Uh, number one selling plant. I don't know that for a fact, but I would probably say it's the number one selling plant that we've had here this season. Why? It's the explosion of color. I, I have never seen anything so beautiful. And when Rochelle comes out, she'll talk about it too. I wanna give it a little turn. It, these are spikes of, of incredible color. Each one of these spikes has hundreds of little, what I call feeding stations for, with, uh, you know, with the pollen and the nectar. So that's why it's called a butterfly bush. Butterflies recognize this, they will flock to your yard, okay? So will honeybees, hummingbirds, all those things will come because there's lots of food, all right? Each one of these little sort of tendril things is loaded with food. It's red, white, and blue purple. So perfect for the 4th of July, okay? So if you wanna get it now and start growing it, you'll have it in full bloom by the time the 4th of July gets here, which I think is amazing. I also love the wildness of it, and Rochelle will talk to that when she comes out. She'll be out in two seconds. And I love the foliage. The foliage is not like a dark green, it's a pale green. It's so beautiful, it offsets the color. Look at the wild shots. These are the shots uh, that you're gonna see next that are out. Look at how amazing that is. What's more amazing? It's $17.95. Buy two, buy three, buy four, I don't care. Buy as many as you want. Rochelle Grayer, who is our gardener extraordinaire, 
is chiming in from Boston. I believe you're in Boston uh, today. Hi, Rochelle. Yep. Rochelle, we cannot, Good morning. we cannot keep this thing in stock. We keep ordering it. They, yeah. they love it. Yeah, well, for good reason, for good reason. I mean, what you're getting here is really, uh, it's, it's basically three plants, um, and that's yeah. how we're getting the three colors. But we grow them from tiny baby plants um, together so that, you know, when it comes, it just looks like one plant, right? And it, it, it basically kind of acts as one plant. Those roots and everything are growing together. But what you are getting is really three times the roots and three times the you know, growth power on the top as well. So, you know, when you're thinking about this, it's, you know, a, a lot basically. And if you've ever grown butterfly bush, you know that it is a very easy plant to grow. I'm up here in Boston. It is very tough up here throughout the, basically the entire lower 48. It can handle the winter. It can handle the heat. It can handle just about anything you throw at it. This particular uh, variety, there are three varieties in here, but this particular shrub has been selected to not grow super big. Up here in Boston, uh, my butterfly bushes, uh, not this one, but uh, basically all of them um, just, they die down basically right to the ground, almost like a perennial, even though they're a woody shrub, but they put on, you know, four or five feet of growth per year, you know, so that all comes back every season. If you're down South, you may not lose all those woody branches, but it'll just be that much fuller and more beautiful yeah. year in and year out. So, you know, this is a tremendous plant that you just really can't go wrong with. It doesn't get out of control. It stays in that nice rounded sort of habit which is also great for containers, whether you want to plant it in the ground or container, you, you know, either one. I love them in containers because it's so simple. One plant, one container. I'd put it in a minimum of a 16 inch container and like you're done for the yeah. season. Like just put it wherever you need let it. Let it go, right? I, you know what I love? Yeah, and and Michelle, you always talk about this and, and I, I, it always puts a picture in my mind. It reminds me of something that you would think that would be like growing wild in a forest, right? You know, something that's begging for attention, like of, of all the creatures to come to it. It's, it puts on this amazing show and display. I love two of them in the front of your yard, right? So if, if you want to flank uh, the entryway, perfect for that, right? Or maybe you've got a little patio garden in the front of your house and you want to put a couple of stars between this and the mini roses, those mini roses are ridiculous, okay? You will have the most beautiful uh, plants uh, in the neighborhood. So, you're wondering, okay, guy, I live way up in the north, all right? We're just getting, the frost is still here. Don't worry about it. Here's what happens. You order today. We know where your zip code is by your order. You will not be charged, or this will not ship until your time is right. So if you live in the northern half of the country, you're gonna be more towards the end of April and May. If you live in the middle of the country, it's gonna be middle of April, late March. And if you live in the southern part, we're already shipping those out because we're in April already. So you will get those directly. Everybody that orders gets one of these. Uh, this is a brochure that will tell you everything you need to know about your butterfly bush, okay? Uh, inside it, there are lots of great tips. There's a, you know what I love to, it's a phone number. There's an 800 number, just call if you got any questions. But it tells you what type it is, whether it's an annual or a perennial. It tells you how much sun it wants, how much water it needs, uh, time to reach maturity. This is only 24 months before this gets to be this big. So in the first year, you'll get about half this, right? And then remember, it's perennial, so so you're, it's going to grow bigger and bigger and get stronger as the roots uh, set up better and better. But look at how gorgeous that is. I have a lot of people. I would imagine I'm talking to my producer Jared. We have a lot of people probably ordering two and three of these right now, Jared. Yeah. So if you want it, get it home. To me, what a great. It's so different from some of the other flowers that we have, Rochelle, but still so beautiful. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, this is one of those ones. I'm a big, a naturalistic type of gardens, a real trend in garden design right now. Things that look a little more wild, a little less of that perfect perfectness that we uh, tend to cultivate in the horticulture industry. We're kind of tending towards more biodiversity and a little bit wilder, a little bit more natural looking. And this is definitely one of those plants. Not only does it have that look of just being a little bit looser. It has those beautiful silvery leaves that are, you know, kind of sage green on the top and like almost white on the bottom. Like it's a really interesting uh, texture and color, uh, but it also is easy to grow and it is a huge uh, food source for our pollinators. So that's another big element of naturalistic gardening is doing something that is right for the environment, right for the ecosystem, right for the planet. And this is one of those. So butterflies, hummingbirds, 
bees. I mean, they're just flocking to these flowers that are, you know, these big cones, they're big. They're, you know, eight inches at least of, of flowers kind of all the way up this stem and they smell amazing. That's the other really great thing about this. They are, um, they're, they're very unique. Nothing else in the garden smells like a butterfly bush. They smell like a hot pot of honey. You know, if you were to warm yeah, up honey, it would make yeah. it extra, extra honey smelling. That's how these smell. So you'll recognize it in the garden if you love a fragrant garden like I do. I, I mean, I, I shop with my nose. Um, I, I, this this is one of those great additions to your garden just for that alone. Um, yeah. Just bring in that beautiful, you know, <clears throat> summer smell. I mean, it smells like summer. Oh, and by the way, these are really great too because um, a lot of the things that we grow tend to bloom early and then uh, they're done blooming by the heat of the summer. You know, when it gets just like too yeah. hot and nobody really mm -hmm. wants to even be outside. These are one of those plants that are going to carry you through that super hot part. They love that kind of climate and they will bloom right through that tougher season when it's a little trickier to get, you know, a lot of real color in your garden and whatnot, because a lot of plants just can't take the heat and they don't want to bloom in that time. A butterfly bush will be the thing that carries you through and really gives you a lot of interest in your garden right through until you get yeah. to fall when we have that big explosion of color again. So oh, yeah. this really is a problem solver too. And I love that you can, you can actually, these, these are great in arrangements because you've got these long stems and they're, and they're pretty stiff, the, uh, the actual uh, stem on this. You can use these in cuttings and mix them with roses or whatever other kind of flower that you want. Remember, if you want butterflies, hummingbirds to come, you gotta put some food out. That's what these do. Plus they look absolutely beautiful. I mean, look at that. It's the, it's, I think it's our, one of our prettiest collective uh, looks in a flower because you got all these multicolors and very easy to maintain. One year warranty, order as many as you want. All right, Rochelle's gonna stand by. Uh, I want to talk about something that's so ridiculous. I, I didn't even know they created it. Remember the guys, or the guy, I should say, that invented the Roomba? I own a Roomba. Maybe you do too? Well, the same guy, Joe Jones, he also created a product called the Weed Robot. Okay? It's called the Turtle Weed Ro Robot. It actually patrols your garden beds and removes the weeds. It toils the soil and, and gobbles up the weed structure. It won't hurt your plants that you're growing, like if you've got tomatoes or whatever else in there, squash, doesn't hurt them, but it, it rotates using that incredible technology to gobble up, watch this, this is with it and without it. It lives in the garden, you never take it out, you never charge it, it works on solar power. You just put it in the garden and let it do its business. We've got ours back there, we just put it in the bed so we can show you how it works. It maps out the space, it knows where everything is, and it toils up and churns up the, the roots of the weeds. That's all it does, and then those are recycled back into the soil. Look at the before and after there, with it and without it. That's one without the uh, weed uh, robot, without the turtle, and the one with it. And remember, the turtle lives in your garden. You never take it out. I mean, you take it out in the wintertime, but in the summer, you leave it out in your garden bed, and it'll chew up those nasty weeds. Never have to deal with it. It's amazing, all right? Regular price, 380 brand new, limited uh, supply. $2.99, it's coming up in my next hour, all right? And I have the inventor, uh, Joe, he's gonna be here with us, so we're excited about that as well. All right, moving on. So there's not much out there that's a, a prettier than daylilies, right? I've got daylilies, um, they, so whoever was in my house before me, or maybe before them, because my house was built in the 30s, they planted lilies out there. I love this time of year because they all start to pop, right? Uh, everybody loves a daylily. First of all, I've never seen daylilies as pretty as this. The ones at my house are kind of a very light lavender color, uh, and I've got ones in white. This is like a fire, uh, corally, reddish, orange, amazing looking daylily. Of course, you have that incredible deep dark foliage on the bottom. You're gonna get three of the bare root plants with this. Gorgeous colors of pinks, purples, and yellows. And remember, these are reblooming. They're called reblooming because a lot of times with lilies, you get one and done, right? These are gonna rebloom, all right? So, so for $20, you're gonna get three of the bare root, which is the way you want it, because these make a lot of flowers. 805-677, Rochelle, take it away. Oh yeah, these, I love that we're putting it together. I think these are a, a choice of color. So um, you, um, you you get to choose right. which color you want yeah. and they come in, you know, three different colors that are very, very pretty. Um, but yeah, as Guy said, you're gonna get the bare root. It looks kind of like this. 
You really cannot mess this up. I know, um, you know, I've, I've, even I, as a very experienced gardener, I've accidentally planted things upside down before, like bulbs. Sometimes it can be confusing. This one's not so tricky. It's got the very obvious roots and it'll always have a little bit of a green thing on top. Sometimes they look like that, so maybe they're a little more confusing. But I'm telling you, even if you put it in the ground upside down, these are so easy to grow that they just they'll put they'll they'll do their whole blooming beautiful thing no matter what you do up here in new england we often call them ditch lilies the wild version of these because literally you could just throw them in a ditch and they'll grow i mean they're they're, they're so easy 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 they are literally the world's easiest garden plant um and the varieties that we have you know are are varieties that have been chosen for their reblooming quality, uh, which is just to say that during their bloom season, which actually goes again, this is, I was just talking about this, uh, plants that bloom in that hot heat of the summer, kind of like the butterfly bush, daylilies will do the same. They love that tough, hot summertime. And every day, we call them daylilies because those blooms last one day, but they just throw another one up and another one up and another one up. And these plants last for generations. We're not talking, you know, decades or anything like that. Generations. Up here in New England, you know, you see lines of daylilies down old stone walls and around foundations. And those are, those are daylilies that have been planted by people's grandparents and great-grandparents. That's how long they last. They grow uh, to actually fill in, but they're very uh, kind of um, uh, th not slow, but they just do it in a nice way. You know, some plants we know they get a little aggressive. These are not aggressive. They just kind of slowly over time get bigger and bigger clumps. They have this beautiful grassy foliage. That's what I love about them. They're a great filler plant, even when yeah. they're not in bloom. They really are a nice texture against other plants and make everything else around them look great. And then when they come into bloom, they're just a real, you know, showstopper of a plant, you know, just yeah. kind of throwing those blooms out constantly. Let, let me show everybody the color. I, I, Cause again, yeah, they, they come in that pinky purple color, which is up front. The ones I have back here are the yellow, whoops, are the yellow and gold. Okay, that's the other ones. And then finally, Look at this, this the turtle's weeding. <laughs> That's the greatest thing I've ever seen. Uh, over here, hibiscus coming up. Here's the uh, the pink color. Okay, so if you want to get three in pink, we have those available as well. All right, 805 677 $20 for three of the bare root. Uh, we'll get you going there. Let me talk about, can I talk about the hibiscus tree real quick, Jared? All right, one minute special, okay? We are doing our hibiscus tree. I, I, we tried to get it and I don't have a lot to go around. When you order this, you're actually, your hibiscus tree is gonna be fully grown, okay? Not fully grown, but about 50% grown. It's gonna be about this tall, all right? And it's shipped to you with buds on it, all right? In fact, can one of you guys grab me that one over there really quick, that, that the braided hibiscus so I can show everybody? Multicolor. What they did is they, thank you, Dave, you hand it right to me, buddy. What they did is they took three, look, this one's already got, it's already got a flower on it. This is a living plant. That's how big your plant is gonna be when you get it, just so you have an idea. They braided the three separate uh, varieties uh, in three different colors. So you have orange, uh, you have the pink, and you have the red. They explode with color. Uh, look at how beautiful. And remember, hibiscus are amazing. Another one of those one day blooms, and then another one opens. Look at all the blooms. Look at all the buds that are on this one that you're gonna get. Comes in a big box. Like I said, it's already a growing, thriving plant. $79.95 if you wanna pick that up. 793037. All right, <clears throat> I'm gonna step back over my little spot. <clears throat> so we aired this, my last show, and we sold out of uh, the purple, and then the pink sold out right after. Uh, this is reblooming fragrant lilac. I don't, I don't know if you've ever smelled lilac before. If you have, you would never forget it. It is my number one favorite scent of a flower. I like it better than roses. Um, I like it better than almost any other flower, I, any other flower. I mean, if I was to put it in order, my favorites are lilac, and then I like um, honeysuckle. Uh, and then I like lily of the valley. Those are the three flowers I think smell. And all of those are, are used in perfumes. I have it available in, per, uh, in the uh, purple, which sold out quickly last time. I'd have available in the pink. My father had these all over our yard. And like, they were like the big, tall, like, like shrubs that were like six, seven feet tall. These are a little smaller version, but you're gonna get that amazing scent of lilac. My favorite, pink or purple, it comes in a very, very uh, large planting already. If you look at that, that's how you're gonna get it. It's gonna grow very, very fast. And I will tell you, when you smell the flowers that come off of this, 
it's abs the only word I can think of is heavenly. I absolutely love it. It reminds me of my dad. It makes me uh, happy and sad at the same time, but I absolutely love them. Uh, Rochelle, we brought these in last week. They sold out in one airing, and they're going to sell out again. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not surprised. No, these are really, really special. Um, and, uh, I mean, if you've grown lilac, they're such a, an heirloom plant that so many of us have fond memories of them growing at grandma's house or, you know, wherever. Because they do, uh, they last for a long time. They're very, um, just the aroma of them. You'll never forget it. Once you get used to it, once you fall in love with it, you kind of crave it. You can't wait for lilac season next year. And that's what's particularly great about this variety. Um, if you've grown them, you know lilac season lasts, I don't know, maybe three weeks or so. All those lilacs come out, that smell just, you know, you kind of, you know it when you smell it. You may not even see the blooms before you start smelling the lilac season that's upon us. But this is a rebloomer. That's what's so exciting about this particular variety. A lot of times we try to bloom, uh, breed reblooming into a lot of plants in the industry. Tree. Um, and it's sometimes more successful than others. We get better at it over time. Sometimes what happens is they rebloom, but they're kind of like these little paltry blooms here and there. They're nothing like the original uh, bloom, you know, cycle that it goes through. This one is particularly great because those the reblooming qualities are actually very strong. So you really are going to get a pretty significant uh, rebloom to this. So, you know, we're extending lilac season, which is so, so nice. And this variety too, it doesn't get super big, three to four feet. So you can also grow this in a container. It's a, it's a little bit smaller one. And then the other thing I love about this, I have a ton of lilacs out in my garden, um, but none of them have the leaves that are quite like this. This one has just a little bit smaller, more fluttery leaf. I have to say, I'm really, really drawn to it. Like, look at that just like shimmer almost in the breeze. I, I, it's kind of like an aspen or a maidenhair fern. It's just really pretty. It has a lot of nice movement to it. So, um, yeah, this is a great. And, and look at this. This is out of the box. Yeah, this is a nice big. size shrub. Honestly, uh, that's it, a great plant. And I always say, if you've never had lilac in your yard, you have to try it. If you don't love, like, like incredibly heavenly, like light, beautiful, fragrant flowers, don't buy this because I'm telling you. And I'm a dude, okay? I, you know, I'm like, I, I mean, I, I appreciate, like I have a very keen sense of smell. That's why I like to cook. I think I've got an extra developed sense of smell. I smell everything. Uh, but anyway, I, I can smell these things from, from like 100 yards away. It's that incredible. And when you put them in your yard, if you put them on a porch or patio, that it's a light fragrance, but it's intense. If, if that's the only way I can, I can say it. And it doesn't smell like anything else, you know? It's funny, a lot of the other scents out there, either they have sweet notes or they have sort of fruity notes. I can never figure out what lilac is. All I know is it's my favorite. It's got something that's just, it's so beautiful. So if you've never tried it, you're going to get either one of the, uh, the purple or the pink. We are extremely busy. It's $24.95. This will be so rewarding. You know, the thing I love about plants, like kids, and I tell you this all the time, is that you put a little bit into it and you get so much in return, all right? And none of the plants that we, that we send you are hard to grow. We wouldn't do that because if you, if you suck at gardening and you're killing your plants, you're not gonna keep buying them from us. So we give you ones that are easy to grow. How do we know where to and when to send them? We, we, we have your address. When you place your order, we look at your zip code and we're like, okay, they live in Montana. So we're gonna wait till the end of April, early May before we send it there. We're not gonna charge you till it goes in the mail. If you live in the middle of the country, same thing. Okay, so April-ish, so probably in the next week or two, if you live down south like we are here in Florida or Texas or Cal parts of California, you're gonna get them directly, okay? So no worries, no issues. We include that, that pamphlet that shows you how to, how to do it. I also love, Rochelle, the color of these because they're, they would be great even if you wanted to use these as cuttings uh, in a little bouquet. Mm. I love that, I love the color because it's a really great sort of lavendery purple. And that pink is kind of, yeah. it's not really a rosy, it's more of a pink pink, you know? Yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm a picky pink person, you know, like I'm not into the candy pinks. I love these more softer baby like what pinks you're wearing. in the yeah, garden. See? I just think yeah. they, yeah, like I'm wearing, yeah. They, they, they just, they make me a lot happier than the ones that are really kind of blaring in my eye. And that's what, uh, that's what this one is. Uh, it goes really well with the, you know, 
lavender lavender <coughs> of the of the of the purple um so if you wanted a combination the pink and purple look gorgeous together but i love the pink too because you know with lilac i mean lilac is the plant it's also we you know lilac's a color it's a color of purple um yeah you know so we're used to seeing it in purple that is the way you see most lilacs um so I, i'm always drawn to something a little bit different a little more surprising a pink lilac i mean that's just not something you see every no, day so i, never saw I, it. I love that yeah for that as well until I mean, we got it on I, our show when people come to my garden they always expect it to have something special so yeah you know a pink I, lilac that's perfect i didn't know me. they even yeah. came in pink so that's why I'm, I'm so excited i've already ordered i already ordered the purple when it sold out i'm going to order the pink today Hey, real quick, we're gonna, uh, Rochelle, give us just one sec. We're 10 minutes away from our next presentation. I wanna read something about our today's special, if I could, Jared, real fast. Roseanne uh, talks about her husband. She said her husband had, a, had a, uh, a medical issue, blah, blah, blah. He was taking meds, he couldn't be out in the sun. So she said, what I love about this umbrella is I can keep my hubby out of the sun and he can still go anywhere he wants in the yard, which is a really big deal. Maybe you're a senior and you can't handle the sun anymore, right? Or maybe you've had some issues, you wanna stay out of the sun, you don't wanna get burnt or, or any of that stuff, use it for that. That nine foot is absolutely huge. Um, it's offset, so you don't have to worry about a pole in the middle, you can put it anywhere, one handle. Crank it up, you don't even crank it, just one push, and it locks into position. I have it available in the red, which I'm standing under. It's available in the navy, I also have it available in a multi-stripe, which is a really cool color. Latte, which is just a really light, light cream color. And then it also comes available in sage, which is a very, very pale green. If you want to get it, it's 89 bucks. It's free shipping. You cannot go wrong with this, okay? I, I'm, I'm $40 less than what we normally do it on sale. Our regular price is what, $159? It's $70 off with free shipping. You know how much it would, how much would it cost to ship this? Guys, you're on probably what, 30 bucks probably to ship this thing. It's big. So you don't have to worry about that. All right, can I walk over here, Jared? I'm walking over here. Mikey, I'm gonna come over here. All right, this is my pick. I, it was hard today because I had butterfly bush, I had lilac, you know, my father, and all that stuff. But I will also tell you that I love roses and I know you do too. You know what the problem with roses is? What color do I want? Do I want that incredibly cool fire orange? Do I want uh, that lovely lavender? color do i want golden yellow or do i want that ruby red what if i told you my pick will get you all four of these you'll get four beautiful little plantings already having buds on them all right within about a three weeks to, to five weeks you're going to have you're going to have beautiful gorgeous plants full of roses in all these various colors i made it my pick because i like that you don't have to pick one you get them all you can keep them, give them. What a wonderful Mother's Day gift, Father's Day gift. If dad likes roses, mom likes roses, you can't go wrong. Is that price correct? Is it $24.95? All right, so let me tell you this. If you want to get a brand new HSN credit card, if you include, because it's free shipping, but if you include your tax, you'll probably be at about 30 bucks. You could use it on that. I, I would maybe, I always like to use the 40 on something that's at least 40 bucks. But if you're in a pinch and you wanna do it, you can. Uh, Rochelle, I love that nobody has to choose that you get all these pretty colors. Yeah, no, you don't. And it's, there's so many things to say nice about these particular roses. Although when you were just talking about giving them as gifts, last year I tried to revive, um, you know, that old tradition of uh, May Day, May flowers, where you leave leave flowers on somebody's door and you, you you know you bring the doorbell and run or whatever. These would be <laughs> perfect for that. They're just yeah. <laughs> anyway, I'm a little childish with that. But I anyway, just had a um, vision. I just had a vision of you running around your neighborhood, <laughs> throwing plants all over. I did. That's actually, an awesome though, thing. That's beautiful. Yellow. <laughs> yeah, they, I did. I did daylilies last year, actually, as, as gifts. But um, no, these roses are fantastic. They're a little bit different than the roses you might think of. You know, like we've done some other roses on the show that are uh, more like the cut flower roses that you get. Um, you know, when you think of long stem roses, these are going to give you uh, a spray rose, which is a different kind of rose. Instead of getting one bloom per stem, you get you know, five, six, something, a whole spray of them. They're smaller, so they're only maybe uh, two inches in diameter at the most, um, but you get a lot of them so that, you know, if you're looking to um, do floral arrangements, I particularly like to work with these in, in, you know, when I'm cutting flowers and bringing them into the house, just because they're so many all at once and you get a little bit, you know, some of them are in bud and so as they sit in your vase, you know, they start to bloom out. And then there's so many colors. I mean, the you've got the, you know, apricot the yellow the red and that lavender so you know you don't have to choose you can get really creative 
with, um, you know, pairing your plants and, and all of that. So the thing that's really great about uh, these roses, though, they're low. They're going to stay small. So these are kind of a front of the border sort of plant. Right. They almost act like a ground cover a little bit, like a tall ground cover. They get a little bit more wide than tall. Um, and they put on color like an annual. They really do. They, they throw out blooms like crazy. It's not what we normally expect from a rose. Roses have this tendency to be, you know, have a reputation for being kind of hard or, you know, fussy or whatever, need a lot of maintenance. These do not need that. These are the toughest roses you could possibly ever grow. They are the ground cover spray. You know, we call them lots of different things, but mini roses um, are just great rootstock, super hardy. I'm up here in Boston. They're very hardy all the way up here, all the way down south. The, the, you know, we pick things, a leaf and petal, because we like things that are going to, you know, be really great performers for the most people in this country, you know, north to south and, and east to west. And this is that kind of rose. They are just tough as nails. They're going to want that full sun. They like the heat. And they're just going to throw out color and beautiful blooms for you, you know, all season long. They're great, great choice. If you just want, if you love a rose, a rose, a ro I mean, roses, they're classic, classic garden blooms for, you know, short change and, and little, little effort. I, I just, I could, I could look at these all day. You know what I love? And you might've said it, um, but I love the fact that, that each stem has like multi roses. It's like, you know, it's not like, yeah. I know you, you always say that I'm, and, and I was reading my notes and I'm like, that's amazing that, that like each little stem, Rochelle, gives you lots of, lots of flowers. Yeah, no, it is. It is. It's, it's unique. That, um, the totally different kind of rose than the long stem rose. Um, you get lots of flowers per stem, you know, sometimes five or six, um, which I, I just think makes it so great for, um, for cutting and bringing into, yeah. you know, your home for an arrangement because it's, it, you know, it's a real bang for your buck. That's how it also gets so many flowers. They're littler, but they, um, you know, they, there's multiple on a stem, but they're able to kind of cover the shrub a bit more. You know, with the, when you have a long stem rose, you know, they're more of like uh, focal point flowers. You know, you get one, you two, you know, you get a lot of them, but they're never going to cover the shrub like this. Um, the spray roses really give you that, you know, real you know, pop of color in yeah. your garden the way a traditional rose really can't. A traditional rose is one of those plants you got to get up close to really appreciate it. This is something, you know, you can stand back from and, you know, somebody's from the street is going to, you know, notice, you, you know, a bank of, of, um, of mini roses because they're just, they're going to be covered in blooms. Right. Yeah. It's just, it's just like a wall of color. It really is. It's that nice. Yeah. And remember, because they're all growing, um, you know, they're all popping at different times. You will always have a nice display in them. Um, now these will take some water because remember, you know, when plants are generating mm -hmm. a lot of flowers, you got to, you have to keep them watered fairly regularly, but that's really pretty much it. If you get an opportunity to get our leaf and petal plant food, I think it's one of the keys, if not one of the biggest keys to my garden. We have that available. I, I don't know if it's written into our show, but we have, we do have plant food uh, available. It's the easiest thing, a little sachet, put it in a gallon of water, mix it up, pour it on the plants. Never could be easier. We'll put that up. But $24 and change for all of these, the red, that beautiful uh, lavender color. Um, the orange is just ridiculous. I, I mean, I can't even believe there are roses that are that color. And then this golden yellow, you're gonna get all of these. There's the plant food I was talking about before, get it. Okay, it's worth it. And by the way, you're looking at the price, you're like, wow, that's expensive. I've had, I've had mine for two years, okay? I do a sachet like once every two to three weeks and you get a ton of them in there. So you're gonna have it, don't worry about it. You just do it like once every two or three weeks, uh, put a little, uh, you know, a little fertilizer in and that'll help them out as well. Everybody that orders will get all of these. It's free shipping and handling today. I just think if you're looking for an instant garden fix, I mean, this is it, Rochelle, right? This is instant, like, okay, yeah. I've got color. I've got things growing. It's not that hard. I just got to remember to water them. They're going to be pretty. I can cut them. I can bring them in the house. I can take them to neighbors who maybe aren't feeling well. There's so many great things about these roses. Yeah, there are. And I just want to say one other thing. We've had a few things in the show uh, between the butterfly bush and the roses and the daylilies um, and even the lilacs. Uh, these are all things that bloom together, specifically these, the daylilies and the butterfly bush. These are going to be blooming together around the same time in that real heat of the summer sort of time frame. And they like the same type of place, that hot, you know, um, 
place that maybe you you know might have some struggled with some other plants just because maybe it gets too hot or too dry or whatever all of these plants like the full sun experience so that's a minimum of six hours a day um and they're going to be super happy with that although i have to say when you're down south six hours a day is not actually that much because you have such long hot days right you know you can actually get away with even part shade um you know in your mind where it's like you know 6 a.m to noon is six hours of sun you know you probably get you probably get that and you know easy up here we might not um it, you know we have a a different sort of um, sun sort of thing. So just think about that. Depending on how south you live, you may need actually even less sunlight and you'll still get, you know, great blooming uh, roses all year round for all <clears throat> season wow. long. <laughs> I love it. I, I think it's good. Look at there's there's already honeybees coming over here. They're going crazy. I don't Look know where that. the squirrel is today. He's hiding. He's a little shy because I'm real close to the feeder. But Rochelle, I, I, always a pleasure every week. I enjoy so much working with you and seeing you. Thanks so much for all the great info. You're welcome. We'll see you soon. All right. Thanks, Michelle. All right. If you want them, last call.